Hey guys, how's it going? So today we're going to be doing the block base, uh, chapter 8, exercise 4. Uh, we're going to start off by drawing a rectangle, and then we're going to draw these three circles here in the center, and then we're going to get the outside dimensions based on these spacings right here, and then we're going to put in these eight circles right here uh, and extrude the rest of it. So I have the final part drawn up right here. So this is what the final part should look like. Go on ahead and get our new part drawing going. And we're going to be doing this on the top plane looking down. So I'm going to start off with a center rectangle. Then I'm going to go on ahead and draw a midline going across. And the same thing going up and down for mirroring later. We know that we have three circles going in the middle. We can go on ahead and select the three of them and make them equal because we know they're going to be the same size. And the radius is given to us as, or excuse me, the diameter is given to us as 2.25. This left hand width is going to be 4 inches. And the spacing on the left right here is 1.75. Same with right here. And lastly, right here. Now we're going to come to this tool right here called a sketch uh, fillet. If it's not uh, easily accessible, you can come up here on your top right to search commands. We're going to put in the radius of 0 0.5 and click these four corners and it's going to get mad at us each time we click it because we did a corner rectangle, but it's not going to matter because the dimensions will stay linked. All right, now that that's drawn, we can draw our four, or excuse me, our circles uh, on top. So we're just going to draw two. The radius, or excuse me, the diameter is 0 0.4. They're going to be the same size. And these points are horizontal with each other. And the center of these are centric, but it's already got that. And the spacing between these two is two inches. All right, now it's fully defined and we can come up here to mirror. We're gonna select these two circles right here and mirror on the right hand side. And then we're gonna do the same thing with the four circles on top and mirror them onto the bottom. Now our drawing's fully defined and we can go to extrude and then for selected contours, make sure that you select just this part. Then we need it to be 0 0.25 inches thick. And that is it for the block base. Comment if you have any questions.